Very tiny. Mr. Speaker, today I want to talk about the great things the Sushi Foundation of Canada does in Surrey, where more than a thousand members live. For the past 10 years, members of the Sushi Foundation Canada volunteer every Wednesday at Surrey Food Bank. Each year, they donate over $10,000 to the Surrey Food Bank to buy baby food for single mothers. Every Saturday, for the last 15 years, Sushi volunteers help Surrey seniors at the Kingsman Place. And for four days a week, they run the hydration program at the se for seniors at the Care Life Fleetwood once a month. Every summer, more than 50 Sushi volunteers clean up the Guilford area through Surrey's Adopted Street Program. But the Foundation's help doesn't stop, just stop there. Since 2004, they have donated more than 30000 per year through the bursary program for students for low-income families and have donated over $150,000 to the new emergency department at the Surrey Memorial Hospital. They provide emergency relief to fire and other disaster victims with $100 per person gift cards and other items. And they just held a winter relief event for Surrey Food Bank where 210 families received packages which included new blankets, food and health and other home care products. They helped the homeless at the front room gateway shelter and 105 people received new jackets, gloves, scarves and socks. This organization does great work in Surrey and throughout the world wherever help is needed. Last month when I was in Taiwan, I met the Sushi Foundation headquarters with many volunteers to bring greetings from British Columbia members. Mr. Speaker, I ask every member in the House to join me in thanking and congratulating the great work of Sushi, all the volunteers of Sushi Foundation and the members do, and especially the Surrey volunteers and donors, including, including Susan Lee and Tom Trong. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.